I don't know what happened yesterday, but that video completely destroyed my computer. More or less. I mean, we already read this, so we don't have to worry about that. But I am gonna suck you. <clears throat> As I was saying before, we are, we know what we have to do. We gotta go back to Jehan. We're pretty much done with this area. But there's some side things we have to take care of. statues these statues we can destroy the statue is a striking sight a sizzling blue totem on a blood red isle even stranger a shard of polished iron peeks from under the statue's base there's something hidden beneath this massive sculpture looking closer you notice the statue's clerical garb so similar to that worn by the ghostly priests bonded to the isle an unlikely coincidence the flame still burns, and the statue still stands. Even a triple-sized troll couldn't make the statue budge. Whatever the stone figure guards remains a mystery. That you know, I think I think I need a. Um, I think I need a scholar to read. Yeah, that's what it is. I need a scholar to read. This. I keep forgetting I didn't give her the scholar tag. Blazing blue flame seems to burn. The hymn twines around the effigy like a fine thread. Guardian burning bright with sourceful flame. Abide the sacred call. Reveal the godsless hall. Winged keeper, song doth bid you break. The priest shall scry the demon's lies. The chains await their captive. From stone to dust. From stone to dust. So there are three statues that have that. We can't really go in there. We can go in there, but we're not going to be able to do anything in there until we fashion these silver bars into silver poles. The thing I want to do first, though, is I want to go back here and destroy these guys. Let's save here. Again, I forget that I have a complete buffoon and not a scholar. Typically, I go with the scholar tag for my main characters. Typically. The noble one is kind of useless. these guys before. Ah, whatever. If you actually got behind him, this would be more or less over. units right away, huh? The other guys are kind of rough. But nothing we can't handle. 
Besides, we're level 16 now. There are three of these things? in the long run. I can be a pain in the ass. She's diseased. Well, I mean, does everything just disease you here?
Totally destroy you, and it's gonna be funny. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, man. to a higher level. Ah, Holy shit! You gotta be fucking kidding me, man. This fucking game annoys the fuck out of me sometimes, really. Just fucking raise him, shit. Finally behind somebody. Somebody else is diseased. Um, that sounds like a spell to me. How the fuck did you do that? That also sounds kind of like a spell to me. How the fuck did you do that? You were fucking silenced. You're a fucking cheating cunt game. You know that, right? There's no excuse for him to do any of those abilities. He was fucking silenced. That's why I specifically selected ga gag order, because I want him silenced. <laughs> Cheating 
cheating fucking cunt. That's what you are, game. You're a cheating fucking cunt. trying to get through the whole thing because there's just too much bullshit that's fucking bullshit i don't understand what they cast that they suddenly can ignore gag order and the overall combat scenario and timing of everything Because, you know, when I had even Sabeel, who has a great amount of dexterity and attack points and all that stuff, even if she was by herself, she's just fucking dead. You just stand there and watch as the opposition destroys your ass. But they can just continue to have attack points and, and combat... and combat... The spirit of a black ring defiler. Opportunities when they are just one of them. So they can just keep fucking doing shit like madness. And again, I gag order is supposed to silence you. Ruined by the So I don't understand why he's able to cast that madness shit. That's a fucking spell. I'll hold these things off. She turns back and cleaves her sword through the air. It makes contact with something. The echo of a bestial roar catches your ear. Druid considers your tale. Yes, she is right. A name holds more power than most of us realize. A drama like. I know of ways to impair such demons. I will show you a place. The treasures there will sap its will while aiding yours. I implore you, let Elanessa be at ease. Then listen for me. When the breeze blows clean, I will be upon it. Secret. I wonder where's that final. I know I have. Do I have two? Or? How many silver bars do I have? I'll put this. I never equipped that. Where are the silver bars? Oh, oh, there's one. Yeah, I do have two. Screw that. Now then, I don't think there's a spot I missed. There's supposed to be three bars. How's this look? <gasps> does it have an extra slot? I don't think it does, right? Now. 
That's 60. Yeah, this one's better. No, 70. I know, again, uh, there might be a third one in one of these hatches, but I know there's, I know there's a third one. Third one, I mean silver. A spectral mass lies before you, not one or two beings, but parts of several, slaughtered together, then left to rot without care or ritual. Disparate glimpses of pain and horror drift past you like a fever dream. A limb is rent from its socket, accompanied by a hollow, ghostly scream. A robed woman crawls away desperately, her face a mask of terror. A sage old dwarf holds his own innards in his hands with bloody bemusement. The spirit of a man in priestly robes drifts from corpse to corpse, head bowed. He murmurs blessings over each of them. Merciful Seven, smile upon your fallen servants. Brother Ashwell, Brother Triscoll, Sister Revria, usher them forth to the Hall of Echoes. He notices your presence. Sorcerer, this island is nothing but death. You should leave. The spirit utters a sigh. Even I wonder what this place was before all this. He retains a heavy heart. This island was once a place of learning, of healing. Well, there you are. That's what it was. To the fringes of our world. Demons. We sought to help those who fell prey to the foul beasts. One of our number, a doctor, brought an invalid before us. An elven maiden who had become infested with some presence. It was powerful. Too powerful. So we sealed it and the poor elf it inhabited in our deepest vaults. Sometimes incarceration was the best we could muster in such dire cases. But the doctor who found her was determined to make a name for himself. He attempted a cleansing ritual, but he only served to strengthen the demon's grasp over the elf. The demon possessed him. Soon the whole island was overrun with monstrosities and bathed in blood. Our blood. It's a corrupt place now. No good thing has cause to be here. You have a silver bar? I, my brothers and sisters, studied the wondrous, the arcane, the malignant. Easier to fight evil forces when you understand them. Our world abounds with demons and dark forces. Those who prey on the weak. They are a curse. But we were a scourge upon them. He casts another rueful look over the mounds of dead. No more. The archives, no. parchment, books, writings about evil things, and the hymn book that guards them. None of it helped us in the end. It lies to the east, beneath the earth, if it hasn't already been destroyed. The statues guard the vaults where we kept those who were beyond help. No ritual could cleanse them of the dark forces that infested them, so we sealed them away. We did not use such cruelty lightly. There was no other choice. The statues guard the path. They will grant passage to those who sing from the hymn book, from the archives. We already knew that. Tangled amongst the mounds of corpses are glimpses of fractured spectral forms. Pleading eyes, grasping hands, wailing mouths. A chorus of cries and moans coalesce into a single mournful voice. You live. We hear your heartbeat. We feel your breath. Come closer. Why have you come here? This island is nothing but pain and blood. We cannot help you with such things. We are beyond it. But you have questions. We can feel them. Ask. We were scholars, priests and priestesses. We sought to study the evils of the world so that we could defeat them. Instead, we were consumed. A dark force erupted from within an innocent whom we had tried to help. It made this island its own and killed 
all that it found. We are beyond help. There is only pain. The archive. It was where all our records were stored. Details of patients who were treated, as well as notes on the demons and evils that we encountered. The archive bears knowledge of dark powers. Few of us were ever allowed. Well, I've already been there, and it's not that interesting. I want to go down there. Brother Abbott, bless your spirit. I don't think it's in the blood cocoon. Package is what you were leaving behind. Because it wasn't really much to, to speak of. I don't know, was there another one somewhere? that we have. We're going to have to find a third. I think it might be here, though. Oh, right, there it is. The Great Forge is black with a sort of ancient work. Inside is a casting for an ornate handle, flecked with glittering bits of silver. So... Obviously. Nice, I guess. Wonder what makes it useful. Do this three times. Because there are three statues we're going to need to blow up. Since those three statues have somebody imprisoned with demons, once we're done with that, we are done with Blood Moon Isle. I don't... That's the archives. They're... They're set up in a specific pattern, so... Was this one of them? Let's go to the one that I know of. The one that I already destroyed. It's let me see. It's it's in this it's these these three areas. Well if I know where they are, why am I not just going there? Where, where? So we'll just do this. The blazing blue flame seems to burn the him twi winged keeper from stoned. Up. All right, so. Okay, when I come back, we'll go in this spot. I will see you then.